Hi, welcome to Backstage Pass. My name is Kim and this is Rachel and we're here at the Detroit Lakes Community and Cultural Center and we're standing in the fitness side massless because masks are not optional so um, if you are out there and interested in coming on in um, both sides both areas are in that capacity now so we do encourage if you're unvaccinated or a little uncomfortable um, pl please just pop your mask on it's not a big deal um, we do have people that are still regularly wearing masks in here so um, not a problem at all so um, but yeah we're excited because we also we are inside only because it's a bit breezy on this particular day um, but you have some fun things outside right uh, Tuesdays in the park is officially starting this week. Yay. Which means it's really officially summer. It is summer. <laughs> summer. We've been talking about Tuesdays in the Park for months, I feel yes. like. It's been like the summer. It's the summer teas. So. Yes. So we have our first Tuesdays this week, June 1st. And we are starting out with uh, the Becker County Dixieland Authority. Okay. And typically, we usually start with the Lakes Area Community Concert Band, but because of COVID and the large amount of people, mm -hmm. they haven't had the opportunity to practice. Um, so some members from that group have oh. formed this Dixieland Band. Cool. And they're great. We had them last year, and they are so much fun. Fun. People really liked them. So they will be opening and closing for us this year. Okay. Excellent. So Tuesdays in the park, every Tuesday night, City Park, 7 p.m., bring a lawn chair, bring a blanket, and and come and sit out and enjoy some free music. Yay. Yeah. Excellent. What and else? then in the next, the following week, then we will have Mike Hulkinson and he will come sing just a lot of familiar favorites. Yeah, very nice. Mm -hmm. And you have, we have an art show right. happening too, so. Correct. We have a, it's kind of called an art exhibition. Oh yeah, sorry. Yes, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, two students who are graduating this year from DL, DLHS, um, they are coming in and they are doing an uh, art exhibit. Cool. And it's, kind, it's, it's supposed to get all your senses. It's visual, it's olfactory. It's um, sound, so yeah. it, it should be pretty neat. We have it set up. Um, so you can see that this weekend on Friday from 5 to 7 and Saturday from 10 to noon. Okay. And that same for the following weekend, same hours. Mm -hmm. So this is free. It's open to the public. So just come on into the homes and come support these amazingly talented students and cool. see some free art. Awesome. Do you have some other stuff happening coming up? Right. Just a reminder, Tuesday's Trucks and Tunes also starts the Thursday. Yeah. Thursday <laughs> Trucks and Tunes also starts this month. Um, the first one is Thursday, uh, Thursday, June 17th. We're starting with Jessica Bynes Band, and that is, again, kind of the same concept of Tuesdays in the Park, except for we have food trucks. Yay. Yay. And so they will be there from 5 to 8 p.m. Come to the park, listen to some music, get some food. You can even get a beer or a glass of wine. Awesome. Yeah. Very nice. So I guess everything, all the schedules for these things are online at our website. And you can also see when you go on there, check out all the art classes we have coming for kids and adults this summer. And there's just tons of stuff on there. I can't even begin listing. Excellent. <laughs> and one thing I do want to point out is that normally, normally this time of year, we are talking about the street fair, which is normally that first weekend after Memorial, but Correct. it is not this year. That's why we're not talking about it this year because it is going to be in August. And yes. so August, August 13th, 13th and 14th. Yeah. We so, are moving it so we can make sure we can have full capacity. Yeah, so, so just that's, that is why. So mm -hmm. it's, it's not going away. It's just going to be in August this year. Probably be back at the earlier yes. time next year. So yep. anyway, so watch for that. Um, so we have lots of things happening too. Our schedule has expanded. Our The summer rec um, opens on June 7th, Monday, June 7th. Um, rain, or, rain, or, rain, it will not be open, but shine for sure. <laughs> um, again, those hours are 9 to noon. Uh, and then one to four, Monday through Friday. Dodgeball happens at three, ping pong happens in the middle of there sometimes, and usually Tuesdays and Thursdays are the craft daytime, so check out that schedule. Uh, we also have an expanded uh, fitness class schedule. Um, we're expanding our outdoor programming. Obviously now um, we're gonna be using the band shell. There's a, camp, there's a class over at the high school, um, a boot camp over at the football field, so check that out. Um, we also have a lot of cycling going on. We have some um, great instructors that are doing some outside bicycling adventures and some hiking and stuff, so, um, so watch for that we're going to be updating our website with a outdoor page um, for those kinds of activities um, if you're out there and you have a student that's looking for an experience that is a really great thing on your on your um, on your college transcript or on your um, on your list of, on your resume um, we have WSI if you're interested in becoming a um, certified uh, certified water uh, swim lesson instructor. Um, we have a WSI class coming up, so that's in June. Um, check that out. We have information on our website, but that is a really good opportunity for a young person. Um, you do become certified, uh, so it is a really great um, opportunity for learning and growth for kids, especially if they're looking at maybe teaching someday. So anyway, so thank you for checking us out. If for all that information and more, visit our website at www.dlccc.org. We'll see you again next week.